So um, in 2022, uh, in the UEA countries, 22,000 cases have been reported uh, with HIV. This means that we are seeing an increase of 30% of the cases compared with the previous years, but it still is not as high as when we compare the data that was reported in 2019, which is the, the, the time before the COVID. So what we are seeing now is cases reported among uh, mainly men uh, that are younger uh, than uh, 40 years old. 40% of those cases are coming from abroad. One of the main challenges is late diagnosis, which means that people that have been reported by the UEA countries are having very low immunity, which means that these people can be sick. Uh, and uh, this just shows that we need to use the data that we are collecting to, to, to tailor the, the testing strategies and the prevention strategies to help or to target those that are in risk to get infection and to lower the time from diagnosis uh, to, for infection to diagnosis and to get treatment as, as fast as they, they, they can. The second challenge is uh, to collect information regarding uh, people that is on move or people that is uh, migrating from one place to another because we know that 50% of the cases that have been reported in 2022 uh, are among migrants. So we need to describe better this, this population to know which strategies they need uh, to use to reduce the, the, the transmission among, among them and to help them to get more prevention strategies to try to tackle the transmission in this population. I think that the main uh, factor is try to describe which are the newly diagnosed and those that have been diagnosed in other places. Uh, because these different populations have different needs for the health planning. So newly diagnosed, they need to be linked to care, they need to start the treatment on time, and they need certain, um, um, cert certain uh, capacities for the treatment of HIV. Whereas the other people that have been diagnosed abroad and is coming with uh, already on treatment, they need to start the treatment immediately and they need some certain supports with uh, uh, mental health, social um, support, and other types of um, a, a help. Also, uh, the completeness of data is important because that will help countries to tailor the, the prevention strategies and to reduce the transmission rate among uh, key populations.